I mean, one of the things I really like about, to me, the great albums have a vibe, have an aura, have a spark. And um, I think, I hope that this one will have that. I think it will. You know, all the songs are as authentically recorded as you could get. We're, we are literally in a farmhouse. We literally don't have internet. We, most of us don't get a cell phone reception here. We're just hanging out and having fun. And, um, and there's a dedication to the songs, a love of the music and a respect for each other as musicians. And, uh, and it's sort of this very organic process that's really coming together. It's going to have that vibe, that cohesive feel. And those are my favorite things because, you know, a lot of albums are done, you know, okay, we're going to do bass and drums today. You guys don't even have to be here. That's a typical thing, especially for a lot of the bigger bands, you know. But you go back to the Beatles or the Stones or the Who, they didn't do that. Like, those songs are great partially because of the energy and the angst of having four or eight tracks and and that was it. Elvis, whatever, you know, pick your guy. Um, and, and they had only... That, that was it, you know, and that energy, the, that session energy was there. And I think that's not there on some modern bands, but I think this one will, I, th I think this album will have that. Rodney, won't you play this song too? Make it loud. 